Braun. Hey guys, what's up? It's Kylie, and today I'm coming at you. Why did I say that? I don't know. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? It's Kylie, and today I'm going to show you guys what is in my purse because I did get a few requests, especially after my friend Alyssa Cardiff posted her what's in my purse. I filmed one of these like a year ago, I'm pretty sure, and I did not like how I looked in it. I also splurged and bought myself a new purse because I only owe $100 more on my credit card, and it used to be in like the 2000 range, so. It's a new year, new me. No, I'm kidding. And before I continue on, I'm so sorry about my hair. I say this in every video, but I'm just so lazy and I don't like doing my hair. And if I do it, I do it like two days before and then I film on like third day hair, which is disgusting, but that's me. Hi. Oh, and if you're new to my channel, then uh, subscribe. I never wash my hair. So I splurged and I bought myself a Kate Spade. When you're so poor, you can't even say the fucking name. A Kate Spade bag. This is my purse. I don't know what the style is. If I can find out, I will leave it below because I left the card over there and I have like a whole setup here. I cannot get back there to grab my card. So anyway, it's just like this little tote looking thing. It's pretty big. I feel like my MacBook will fit in it. I should probably test that. It has a long strap, which I always use. I don't really use these short straps. I was going to get a tote and get like these shorter strapped ones, but I know I would regret it, especially when I go to school in September. I want this to be kind of like my purse backpack thing if shit will fit in it. I feel like textbooks will fit in it. It's pretty big, but I don't want to carry around on my arm. I don't know. I don't like the look of this. Legally blonde. <laughs> so this bag is everything I've dreamed of. No, I'm kidding. The bag inside is pretty big. It has a little two side pockets, I guess, for your phone or something. It has a little inside zipper. And then it has two big zippers on the outside, which are two more compartments, which is exactly why I bought it because, I don't know, I think that looks cute and I like it. First, I'm going to start off with the back zippery pouch because I feel like good shit's in here. Oh yeah, this is a good shit. So the first thing I have is a little mini bag that I got in my Ipsy bag. And if you guys want to see like monthly Ipsy opening things, then let me know. I put my little lip injections by Too Faced in there because I like to use this. Oh my god, do not mind my nails. I have so many excuses for this video, but like look how disgusting. I'm just showing you guys real me. I don't have my fucking nails done all the time, so sorry. This is a lifesaver, especially if you want your lips to look fatter. You know, like Kylie Jenner. No, I'm kidding. I do not want to look like Kylie Jenner, but I love this shit. The next thing I have in here is the Smith's Rosebud Salve, and I just bought this from Sephora because I hear everyone talk about it. I just feel like I'm putting Vaseline on my lips, so I could have saved a lot of money and just bought fucking Vaseline. I got the original kind, the Rosebud kind, because I don't like strawberry and I don't like chocolate, and I think those are the only two flavors they had at my Sephora. The next thing I have is a concealer because I think it is so important to have an emergency concealer in your bag, especially if you get the odd blemish. I don't know, I like to cover my shit, you know? This is just, it's a lifesaver. And I have it in the 20 sand and it's the Maybelline Fit Me. I also think it's really important to have an emergency mascara because if you are obsessed with your eyelashes, like I am, like I need to have my eyelashes looking good all the fucking time. I'm obsessed with eyelashes. I think that eyelashes are a big thing that people look at because people usually look at your eyes, your mouth when they look at your face, you know? So I have the It Cosmetics Superhero and this one came in my Ipsy bag as well. And I think it's pretty good. I don't know, I have no complaints. I also have my favorite lipsticky glossy thing lip paint at the moment it came in my sephora birthday package but it's a tartiste lip paint and i think birthday suit yeah it's right there cool i have it on my lips right now so i don't really need to swatch it you guys can just see it the next two things i have are brow products and the benefit gimme brow came in my ipsy bag too and i like it just just keep them there you know and a spoolie to brush it out obviously because i don't know what i would do if i didn't have a spoolie in my bag i'm obsessed with brushing my eyebrows or brushing my eyelashes in that compartment i also have a mini dry shampoo that my mom's friend gave me she gave me a shit ton of like little samples. This is the Volume Extreme by one I can't read cursive. I literally don't know. Ruth Krilly or something? A model recommends. This is what it looks like. I don't know. It smells pretty good and I just have it in here because it's travel size and packing my Batiste extra, extra large volume dry shampoo in my bag would not be ideal because it's pretty big. I also have a Mari Badescu rose water spray and I use this all the fucking time. I literally just got this recently and it's already down here so you can see how much I use it. I like to spray this in my hair, on my face, literally everywhere. And I have Reactin because I'm allergic to the world. Like I said in my Snapchat story, if you guys don't have me on Snapchat then it's gonna be in the description box or on the screen somewhere. But I have little reactant pills because I'm allergic to the world, like I said, and yeah, you get it. So that was it for that compartment. I'm gonna move into the other zipper compartment, which is right there. First thing I have are tampons because I'm a girl. Next, I have a nasal spray. Is that girl in Ned's Declassified School Survival Guide? I don't really know what her name is. She like squirts it in her nose. Yeah, I need this. I need to blow my nose every day and I need to squirt two sprays in every nostril because I'm allergic to the world, like I said. And if I don't, then I'll sneeze all day. I also have my Fermu glasses, which are my reading glasses or my seeing glasses if I'm driving and I can't see street signs. I put these babies on and I'm good. I did a little review on these in my April favorites video because I am obsessed with them. They're really dirty right now, but I love them so much. I like the way they look. I feel like they're different than any other reading glasses that I've seen people wear. I think they're really cute and Tumblr-y, Instagram-y. I don't know. 
I'm a wannabe. But they help me see and I, I love them. And I'll put a link in the description box if you guys want to get a free pair of glasses. I already pretty much did a video for them, but I love them so much. So shout out to Fermu again if you guys are even watching this. Thank you so much again. So that was it for that zipper compartment. Wasn't as loaded as the other one was. So I'm going to go into the big compartment. So in the big compartment, I have my Michael Kors wallet. It has all my shit inside of it. My debit card, no cash because I don't like carrying around cash. I don't know if I'm the only person. This was supposed to be in one of the zipper pockets because I don't like having pills just chilling around in my bag because people can see them or probably like what the fuck are you a drug addict but I have my doll because you know periods I have a Lone Star Be Our Guest which is for a free appetizer from now until June 1st so I gotta go there and I gotta use this because Lone Star is my shit their chicken fingers are so fucking good the last thing I have in my bag are a pair of Ray-Bans and these are from smartbyglasses.com I am obsessed with their website honestly they have such cute affordable glasses and I really like the pair that I picked out so as you can tell by the title of this video there is a giveaway going along with this. So you guys will be winning this pair of sunglasses from smartbyglasses.com. Uh, something happened where I got two pairs, so I decided to give a pair to you guys because where would I be without you guys, you know? So this is the pair that I'm going to be giving away. I haven't used them yet. I just opened them for this video and I stuck them in my purse because the pair that's getting sent to me in the mail will be in my purse. So I'm kind of showing you guys like what's in my purse, but they ain't here yet and I'm giving you guys these, you know? So these are the pair of sunglasses that I got. They're a little dirty because I literally just tried to figure out how to open them. So they're really cool how they bend. They're very very, very, very convenient to like shove in that little box, you know? Like, look at this. Like what? So this is what these pair look like. I think they're really cute and really retro if you guys are into that whole kind of thing. I don't know, I feel like they just look good on everyone, you know? So if you guys want to win this pair of glasses from Smart Buy Glasses, then comment down below a video request because I need a lot of those. I feel like that's the most efficient way to get video requests. This is a bribe. Comment video requests, you know? They're like a purple hologrammy yellow type color and I think it's so cool. I've never seen a pair of glasses look like this. They change color when the light goes on them. So it's like purpley yellow ombre. I think they're so cool and I'm so excited to see one of you guys wearing this. The only requirements for if you win these are send a picture of me because I really want to see what you guys look like in them because I think that these just look good on everyone and they're so retro and just so unique and I just love them. I want to say thank you to smartbyglasses.com because I would not be able to do this without you guys. You guys would not be getting a free pair of designer sunglasses without smartbyglasses.com so make sure you guys check the link in the description box because they have really good deals on brand name sunglasses and there are so many designs to choose from. So that was everything that is in my purse or in my bag. Thank you guys so much for watching and thank you so much to the people that requested this video. You guys really helped me out telling me what you guys want me to film. I don't know. I like it when I know I'm sitting down and filming something that you guys want to see so make sure you do comment video requests. Good luck to everyone that enters in this giveaway, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Okay.